Good morning, and welcome back to the channel. So, it's been a while since I've done one of these particular videos, and um, as I was sitting here thinking about in my car, I was thinking about, okay, I'm going to be a Lincoln Tech, and uh, I'm going to be able to know how to work on diesel engines, and as well as the... Uh, as well as my the cars that I'm gonna specifically own. Now it's gonna be I got two cars. Now the third one's on the way. Uh, just in case both cars go out of service, I have another one on hand, and uh, doesn't really affect the insurance or nothing. No. But what I'm really thinking about is, you know, when I go to Lincoln Tech, I'm gonna study real good. I don't worry. I mean, most stuff is just hands-on at that point. But more importantly, if I look at it in a certain way. It's mainly me, basically about me making the money because, it, you know, there's a lot of money that can be made out here. And especially out here in Chirac because think about it, people need mechanics to work on their cars and I'm gonna be one of them anyway. Uh, that was never out the picture. But, uh, you know, as I'm sitting here thinking about it, it's just a lot that I'm looking at that just need, that there's so much potential out here. It's so much money to be made and then there's so much potential too. So, therefore, I'm just taking advantage of the opportunities I have since I'm about to be turning 20 in a month. Not well, even less than a month than that. But, uh, yeah, so, other than that, that's all I'm really thinking about. Uh, and another thing. So, people have been asking me, you know, for the reviews, you know, the 5800 series is coming out today. And I promise you that right now, I, tr I truly do. Because I think that you know, it kind of gets overlooked sometimes, especially when it comes to, you know, just the just the regular stuff that I'm looking at is just overlooked. And when it comes to items like that, I try to make sure that when it uh, when I do reviews, it is done appropriately and everything is accurate. So therefore, there should be no mistakes such as, you know, with the 1995 Flexible Metro E series that I specifically mentioned a while back. So, um, but I think the biggest one over the summer that caught a lot of people's attention was mainly the 1985 Flexible Metro, uh, fuck, not the, the 1985 uh, Man Americana. So that one was, um, that one was mainly the, the breadwinner of the summer. Uh, that one's gotten quite a bit of attention too. It did. And uh, either way, I mean, it's good because that, that just shows you that people have been watching your videos and they actually respect the work that you do. And that's a good thing because, you know, let's think about it. how often do I really make videos. I never thought I would be doing bus reviews until now. And I've just realized that and I'm like, okay, let me try to improve and try to make every, make sure everything's done appropriately. And that's all I'll look at. But yeah, other than that, that's pretty much about it. So I'm going to go ahead and think about a couple of things for a little bit before I got to go pick up my uh, my mom from the doc, her doctor's appointment because today is her doctor's appointment. And uh, get my ass back on back to Evergreen, you know. So that's the end of the video. Like, comment, subscribe. I catch you all in the next video. And as always, long live the Good Trek Road. The GT the Real Fan 1995 signing off.